A North Manchester creative has spent her lifetime as a student and a teacher of the arts, determined to build a career out of both, out in 21 Country. I don't overthink when I create. I like that feeling of like, I just cut that apart and I like the feeling of just laying it here. And when I don't like the feeling of something, then I just move it away again. Hannah Burnworth is a maker of mixed media. I constantly carry a scrap bag around with me. My pieces are usually, they have things in them that have like a second, third, fourth life sometimes. Creating collages during the rare, quiet time in her studio. You want to really push the dark to the light. Which also doubles as a classroom. There are examples up here. Yeah. And the passions feed each other. Like I can't really consider myself a teacher over an artist or an artist over a teacher. I, they just have become kind of one thing. Now, believe it or not, as a student herself, Burnworth almost majored in business but a trip abroad changed her perspective. I ended up spending a year and a half in Germany, and while I was there, I took art classes to pass the time because I was a nanny, and uh, I realized this is what I love. Balancing a hectic life, essential to doing both well. As a teacher, I kind of realized, okay, I have to return to the artwork because I want to remember what it's like to create. I want to remember the struggles that students are going through, and I want to be able to connect with them and, and keep learning my own profession, and that is a huge part of professional development, I think, if you're in the arts. I really got into mixed media work when I had children nine years ago because I had to have something that I could do in small pieces, like piece together, and then I could come back later and sew things into larger compositions or take these smaller pieces and collage them back together. Um, and so that's when I really kind of created the style that I work in now. Immersed in a buzz of creativity. You already know what you're doing. All day long. At a high school of 400, I have 12 Google Classrooms. So I am in charge of drawing one, two, three, painting one, two, three, printmaking, AP, 2D, 3D drawing, on and on and on inspiring others to take a similar journey. One thing I definitely want to encourage through my artwork is spending time doing things that bring you joy and fulfillment. As a teacher, giving students opportunities to make something with multiple solutions. So making sure that they know that there's never one path and that they can take many paths and, and reach the same spot. I think that that is such an important part of teaching art and kind of shucking sometimes what public education can become, you know, and giving them an opportunity to, to really think. Well, last school year, Hannah had four students graduate with plans to pursue an art degree in college, so that's a good success rate there. She says even more this year, they're planning to do the same. If you're interested in following Hannah Burnworth's art journey or in buying some of her work, mm. we have links to that on our website, WPTA21.com.